The aim of this experiment is to generate 3D tissue-like spheroids. This is accomplished by first harvesting cultured cells and then generating a single cell suspension. Next, drops of the cell suspension are deposited onto the underside of the inverted lid from a tissue culture dish. Then, the lid is inverted onto the hydration chamber. The final step is to incubate the hanging drops for 24 to 48 hours to allow aggregates to form. These can then be transferred to a shaking water bath and incubated for up to five more days. Ultimately, results can be obtained that show differences in aggregate cohesion or cell sorting through compaction assays, tissue surface tensiometry, or epifluorescence microscopy. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods, uh, like conventional 2D tissue culture, for example, is that cells grown in 3D more closely mimic cellular interactions experienced by cells in a tissue environment. I'll be demonstrating this method to show you that it's so simple that even a PI can do it. To begin this experiment, harvest adherent cells at 90% confluency. First, Aspirate the culture media and rinse the cell sheet twice with PBS. Then, aspirate the PBS and pipette 2 ml of 0.05% trypsin EDTA solution onto the monolayer. Place the plate into the 37 degrees Celsius tissue culture incubator and incubate until cells detach. Next, remove the plate from the incubator and halt trypsinization by adding 2 ml of complete medium. Use a 5 ml pipette to triturate the mixture until the cells are fully in suspension. Then